Hey guys, it's JC Theater Yu-Gi-Oh! here today and I'm coming at you with a little opening of the GameStop exclusive Obelisks of Tormentor Yu-Gi-Oh! Funko Pop. Now as you see behind the box here in the background, I do have the other Funko Pops in the series. The only ones that I'm missing are this Obelisk here that I'm about to open and then uh, Hot Topic had a Slifer the Sky Dragon which sadly ended up uh, being some weird with COVID or something like that. The point is people ended up uh, not being able to get it, but like I've noticed some like secondary retailers have gotten it. It's just uh, a mess with that. So uh, Slifer, maybe one day we'll open on the channel, but for now we have Obelisk and no sign of where Raw is coming. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be some kind of exclusive probably, but without further ado, let's get into opening this bad boy up. So I will say as we open this, I'm kind of worried because if you look at the box here, head on it is quite crushed a little bit see there um i noticed with my exodia the forbidden one unlike usual funko pops uh the six inch ones just have like the paper around them and not like the uh extra box so hopefully i also don't want to get too deep with this because like i said the box is usually not protected but uh, hopefully this just damaged the paper. Um, this will be a sad video. I don't even know if I'll post it if it's damaged. Maybe I will. Maybe like just got a damaged obelisk in or something. Let's see. Pop this open here. Okay, nice. The, uh, of course it worked out perfectly. The damage was on this side and the Funko Pop was on this side. Uh, very, very good. Um, very good luck there. And if we see here, if it damaged this side, it would have been game over. So let's pop this out. Let's move the box to the side and we can take a closer look at this guy. Okay. So we have here Obelisk the Tormentor, the GameStop exclusive. Very, very cool. Very heavy, not like super heavy, but for a Funko Pop, definitely with like the wings and everything in there. This definitely has some heft to it. Um, I don't like taking Funko Pops out of the box. I'm sorry I won't be able to show uh, that on camera for you guys, but we can see here the cool little cartoon, the Funko cartoon version of it, which uh, stuff like this, you know, with that aren't really humanoid much um, are usually interesting to look at on Funko Pops because it's not just the usual like Funko Pop face with like the clothes of whatever character. It's more like, custom sculpted and everything and I don't know this is just very very cool and very very awesome this is a short little video just showing off the uh, obelisk Funko Pop I keep showing that side let's go around this side one more time see the horns and everything the hair this is honestly I think the coolest looking Yu-Gi-Oh Funko Pop and I'm not just saying that because it's like a god card the just the custom everything it just looks very very well crafted well done and with that, I say thank you guys so much for watching this little opening. Uh, I really wanted to open this as soon as possible once I saw the box to make sure it wasn't damaged and it isn't. So thankfully for me, now I have another six inch to add to the collection. I'm JC Theater Yu-Gi-Oh! I'll see you in the next one.